Now, back to our show. Okay, this is Attorney Vince Davis with my co-host, Cynthia Becker, and this is The Secret, How to Fight Child Protective Services and Win. Our next caller is from Lori Beth in Texas. Lori Beth, are you there? Yes, ma'am. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Thank you for asking. Do you have a question or a story? Um, kind of both. So I'm uh, I was a victim came home and CPS came in last um, um, October and removed both my girls. Um, we're two weeks away from adoption on allegations of like there was no um, abuse, neglect, or any of that. I I don't understand the question, Lori Beth. Okay, so I was a, I was two weeks away from adoption. Um, um, they're my friend's kids, and um, CPS came in and removed them because my husband and my sister made up some accusations against you. Yeah, like there was no safety, neglect, or abuse, and I lied on my home study about um, being related to um, the mom, but like. I mean, we call each other cousins, best friends, sisters, but, I mean, everybody does it this day, these days, but... No, 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 Lori, Lori, Lori. Everyone doesn't do it. Oh. Okay, and, you know, if you were in California, that would be a crime. So, don't lie on government forms. But I admitted to it and everything. How long had you had the children? Um, I had the baby for 18 months. You know, there are, you know, if you were in California, you there are some things you could do uh, to try to get the child back. But, mm-hmm. you know, most judges, you know, if I'm a judge, I'm thinking, why is this lady lying? I don't know if I can trust her. I don't know if I should return the child to her. You know, judges are big on people telling the truth, as you might mm-hmm. imagine. Don't think mm-hmm. people lie you know, just randomly or about things because everybody does it. Don't do that. It's going to mm-hmm. put you in a bad light in the court system, right. whether you're here in California or in Texas. Right. So if you're trying to get these children back, what I would do in your area um, is go to an attorney, find an attorney that's an expert in this area, and talk to him or her and have them come up with a plan for you. Now, um, I don't know how much the attorney's going to cost. I just don't know. But expect mm-hmm. to pay, you know, 100 bucks, 150 bucks um, for a consultation. Mm-hmm. Generally, free consultations are worth what you pay for. Right. All right. You want to get a consultation, a silent con- consultation, you know, that might last an hour or more to give you information on what you need to do to get these children back. Okay? Mm-hmm. And by the right. way, you know, your husband... And the mother of the child who isn't really your relative, that's a bad combination of witnesses to have against you. Well, no, the mom wants the kids with me. It's my sister. Oh, your sister? Well, that's even worse. Your sister and your husband are against you? Yeah. Right. That's a... But I have, like, I have, like, all the proof and everything. Like, I have, like, massive amount of proof. I have have a trial coming up on the 28th. Oh, good, good, good. So you have a, a right to try to uh, vindicate yourself. Right, but I just need an attorney. Oh, you don't have an attorney? Uh-uh. Have you done a search? You know, have you gone um, out and talked to, um, you know, at least 50 attorneys? Have you let your fingers do the walking? Have you gone on um, Google and searched? Yes, I have. And, like, so in my area, um, like... It, uh, we called, like, I don't know, like 15, me and the baby's godmother. Um, we called, like, 15 attorneys, and they were like, well, they were, like, linked to the case somehow. Like, mom, dad, you know, so it's how like many attorneys? Area. How many attorneys have you called? Like 20, 30 maybe. Okay, you got 20 more to go under the Cynthia Becker method. <laughs> okay, so keep calling. <laughs> and you know what? You can call in other cities. Like, don't say where you are, but if you're... You know, if you're not in Dallas, call Dallas. If you're not in Houston, call Houston. You know, if you're not in Lubbock, call Lubbock. You know, mm-hmm. call around and find someone, Fort Worth, wherever. Call and try to find an attorney, okay? You're not going to, okay. in my humble opinion, you're not going to win without a good attorney. So you better find what? one, 
Okay, Lori. Hey, Lori, okay. Beth, thank you for calling in. Keep listening. And, you know, in a few weeks, call us and let us know how that trial turned out, okay? All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you.